These are the most powerful militaries in the world. The ranking is based on manpower, land units, naval strength, and air forces. If you're wondering where North Korea and Kim Jong-un ranks, they're only 30th on the list. Sorry, Kim. These are the top five militaries today. Welcome to Explained. Let's start with number five, Japan. For a country that's only as big as California, Japan proves that size doesn't matter. This island nation has a defense budget of $47 billion per year and 309,000 military personnel. And this includes active, reserve, and paramilitary forces. But don't be fooled by these small numbers. Its army has more than 1,000 tanks and 5,500 armored vehicles. This includes the AAV-7 amphibious assault vehicle that can carry troops from ship to shore and through rough water. And they also have the Type 16 maneuver combat vehicle that's lightweight and fast but capable of taking on enemies twice its size. Japan's navy has over 155 assets. That's as much as the UK and German navies combined. It has the second largest fleet of helicopter carriers and 22 vessels dedicated to planting underwater mines that can sink unsuspecting ships. Japan is also working on two new anti-ballistic missile destroyers worth $4.8 billion. That's going to be among the biggest in the Pacific region. Its air force is very well equipped as well, with attack helicopters like the AH-64 Apache and F-35s from America. Japan is also working on its own fighter jets dubbed FX for now, that experts say will be better than many Russian and Chinese aircraft. But when it comes to overseas military bases, Japan has only one in the Republic of Djibouti. Number four is India. With 1.3 billion people, India has one of the largest populations in the world. So it's no surprise that it also has the largest military manpower with over 5.1 million personnel. Its defense budget is $49 billion, and while it develops its own firepower, it also buys weapons from other countries, especially Russia. Let's look at its army. It has tanks like the T-90 Bhishma that can drive on almost any kind of ground, and long-range artillery guns like the Danush that can fire three missiles in 15 seconds. India is also nuclear-powered with an intercontinental missile called the Agni-5, and it has a supersonic cruise missile built with Russia called the Brahmos that travels three times the speed of sound. With a 7,500-kilometer coastline to protect, the Indian Navy plays a key role in its defense system. Among its warships is a massive Russian origin IAC-1 aircraft carrier that can carry up to 30 MiG-29K aircraft, 17 submarines, three of which are nuclear. India's also made big investments in its air force, buying a fleet of French Rafale fighter jets that can launch attacks 150 kilometers away and a large fleet of American MQ-9 Reapers. In terms of overseas bases, India has set up in nine countries and is reportedly setting up a new secret base in Mauritius. The third on our list is China. China has a defense budget of $250 billion and not surprisingly, has over 3.1 million military personnel. Its land forces have the second largest fleet of rocket projectiles and self-propelled artillery. In fact, China has some crazy tech like corner shotguns, but it's never really shown off its military strength until 2019. China put some futuristic weapons on display like an intercontinental ballistic missile that has a range of 14,500 kilometers and can carry 10 nuclear warheads. And in July 2021, China tested a hypersonic missile that circled the globe in space before hitting a target in its own country. China's navy is the largest in the world. It has more submarines than any other country, six of which are nuclear. It also has two massive aircraft carriers and Type 022 missile boats that are designed to deflect radars from fighter jets. Now, having numbers is great, but we all know that any warship is only as good as its weapons. Knowing this, China is working on a weapon called the Electromagnetic Railgun that can strike a target 200 kilometers away at a speed of 2.5 kilometers per second. Its air force is also rapidly expanding. China has fourth generation Su-35 fighters from Russia, J-20 stealth fighters and combat drones like the Sharp Sword. Also in its final stages is a stealth bomber called the H-20 that experts are comparing to some of the US's most advanced drones. In terms of geographical advantage, China only has one military base in Djibouti with 400 to 500 military troops. The second most powerful is Russia. Russia's military has 1.3 million soldiers and a defense budget of $154 billion. Well, let's talk about Russian weapon technology that has caught global attention. Its main military tank is the T-90, and its Contact-5 armor can apparently withstand an attack from an American tow missile. 
Russia has short-range ballistic missiles like the Skander and rocket launchers like the Grad and Smirch. It also has the second largest navy. Its warships carry the deadly caliber cruise missile and its K-222 nuclear submarines are the fastest in the world. Not to mention the massive aircraft carrier it has called the Admiral Kuznetsov. When it comes to Russia's air force, it has Tu-160M bombers, Su-35 fighters, and over 300 attack helicopters like the Ka-52. It's also working on a new stealth bomber known only as Pakda. But what enemies really need to watch out for are the Kinzel hypersonic aero-ballistic missiles carried by the MiG-31K interceptors. Outside of its borders, Russia has at least eight known military bases. Finally, at number one, we have the USA. The US has just over 1.8 million military personnel, and while the number isn't as large as China and India, it is the world's best fighting force. Here's why. America has a budget of $770 billion, and its weapons technology is incomparable. For starters, the M1A2 Abrams tank are the most feared on the battlefield. But the biggest device on the U.S. stockpile is the B-83 nuclear bomb that can deliver 1.2 million tons of TNT. It's also developing some new weapons, one being the Excalibur S missile that can be fired at a target 70 kilometers away. That's like firing from the Statue of Liberty in New York and hitting a target in Princeton, New Jersey. The other secret weapon being tested is a 300 kilowatt laser gun that can take down drones and floating targets. The U.S. Navy is top-notch, and its biggest advantage is its 11 aircraft carriers that can hold up to 60 fighter jets each. Oh, and let's not forget their nuclear-capable submarines. The most impressive part of the American military is its Air Force. It has F-35s and F-22s and a large fleet of B-1 and B-2 bombers. But it doesn't stop there. The U.S. have quiet and lethal drones like the MQ-9 Reaper, which is designed for high-altitude and long-duration missions, the MQ-25 Stingray that can refuel up to four F-35s mid-flight, and the X-47Bs that can take off from warships. In terms of overseas bases, the United States has more than 750 across 80 countries. That's more than all the other overseas military bases of other countries combined. The destructive capacity of these weapons is scary. And while countries around the world continue to update their weapons technology, it's important for world leaders to choose peace over using firepower. Let us know if you agree in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to Explained.